Primus gas lanterns spread light and heat effectively and are really easy to use. Mind you, fitting the mantle might seem a little bit complicated at first, but as you'll see, it's not difficult at all. And remember that you won't have to do this very often anyway. To change the mantle, first remove the glass. The mantle has two openings, a large one and a small one. Start by sliding the large hole over the burner stem. Now, slide the mantle all the way down the perforated part of the burner. Adjust it so that the small opening of the mantle goes over the top of the burner like this. You also need to make sure that the igniter, here, is fitted inside the mantle, but not through the hole. You don't want the igniter too close to the hole because this could affect the shape of the mantle later on when it's lit. Make sure that the mantle is not crumbled and looks something like this. Now, light the mantle and burn it down to a brittle shell. Don't switch the gas on just yet. Simply light the mantle and let it burn until every part of it is burnt. Turn on the gas and ignite with the piezo igniter. Let it burn for about 30 seconds and then turn it off. Slide the glass back carefully so that you don't damage the mantle. If you're using a glass lantern like this and you have a hole in the mantle, you might get a pointed flame which could crack the glass. Primus has several different models of gas lanterns and also LED lights if you prefer. Gas lanterns give you both light and heat, while an LED lantern only emits light. But it's easier to use and can be used in enclosed spaces such as small cabins, tents or boats. If you want to know more, go to Primus.se.